While I'm making this speech, I will make the subject of close relation online with the circus of psychology. With my sister, graduation from the psychology department, my interest in psychology and human relation increased. So, I started doing research on my own, and the first thing I questioned was why we had a close relationship with the other people. By close relationship, I mean, for example, it was relationship with which we are constantly in traction, such as family, close friends, friends, partners. Why did we want to be in constant communication or interaction with these people? I thought, why when any positive or negative event happens to us to during the day, when we hear new, make plan and make decision, we feel the need to share our feelings and thoughts in this process with the people grand close relationship. After a while, I got the information that could answer this question and I would like to share them with you. The sentence I created the most when skin on the circus was to belong to someone, to a society. It's not a desire, but a need. And if we can say need about the station, it comes up as an evolutionary, innate and fundamental part. The need to belong to us as this evolutionary and basic part is a motive, to put in a word. People have to drive to establish close relationship with meaning, with continuity, if at least a few. We are social beings. We are born with the tendency to be a social. The first people we met when we came into the world is our families. The ties we establish with our families are harbinger of the ties we will establish in our future close relationship. According to the Bowley, the bonds we establish with our parents are divided into the four as safe, insecure, anxious, and evasive. If I give an example of this situation, if we have a secure connection, we will also achieve positive results in our future close relationship. If we have an insecure affectment, we will also achieve negative results in our future close relationship. A child with an insecure affectment may be in constant doubt in his future romantic relationship. He thinks of thoughts that his partner doesn't like him. He will gonna leave him or cheat on him and he can never trust on his partner 100%. Safe or insecure affection varies according to the fact that our parents meet our basic love. Shelter and nutrition need in a healthy way from the moment we are born. This is a sign that we actually have a need to belong to from the moment we are born. Of course, naturally, it's time we don't remain a baby throughout our lives or need to connect with different people outside our family after entering the social circles and social roles in life is realized. If I give an example of these roles, it can be student role, partner role, friends role. In fact, as with everything else, our close relationship progress in their nature flow in our process. In order to live and keep this process alive positively, we must carry the act in a way. Without prejudice, with empty, by showing respect, with understanding. Because we are all the same among us, we are all part of this motive to the beautiful tomorrows that will pass without hurting each other. Like Gorgi Gospondinov says, if someone wants to love someone, it can be considered proof of their own existence. Thank you.